shrimp is spicy. You want a Tums? You got the tropical fruit kind? No, if I buy those, I just go through them like candy. Tell me about it. One time, I swear I pooped out a stick of chalk. <laughs> I'll get it. Thanks. Hi. Oh, hi. I may have overreacted. Uh, yeah, well, I didn't handle it so great either. It's just sometimes I feel like you enjoy spending time with your friends more than with me. That's not true. It's not? You spend all day together at work, and then you all hang out at night playing games, going to the comic book store. Last week, you two got a couple's massage. <laughs> so when you said you wouldn't want to spend that much time with me, it really hurt my feelings. Oh. Well, yeah, no, I get that. I'm so sorry. Starting tomorrow, I am turning over a new leaf. Time with you is my number one priority. <laughs> Why tomorrow? Well, we're real close to finishing off the new Batman game. <laughs> it is awesome. Uh, you should probably go after her. Should I go after you? Thanks for getting me in trouble. <laughs> Amy. 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 Sheldon, what are you doing here so late? I couldn't sleep because I kept thinking about what happened earlier between us. Also, I had one heck of a bus nap. <laughs> oh, speaking of which, do you want some mutton and coconut milk? No. Boy, I cannot give this stuff away. What do you want? Amy, this isn't easy to say. All relationships are difficult, but even more so when you're in one with a person who struggles with everyday social interactions, and frankly, who can strike some people as being kind of a weirdo. Sheldon, you're not a weirdo. I wasn't speaking about me. I mean, honestly, there's no telling what will set you off. You know, introducing myself as your boyfriend, giving you the opportunity to drive me home, you know, breaking the ice with your colleagues using ethnic humor. It's the funniest kind of humor. What's your point? My point is, we're a couple, and I like you for who you are, quirks and all. I like you, too. I should hope so. I don't see anyone else banging on this door to put up with your nonsense. <laughs> Not even a goodbye. You see, that's the kind of thing that makes people think you're weird. Poor kid. She just doesn't see it.